Howdy folks, Max Mogren here, oilfreefun.com with a quick tutorial on making your own Skywatch time lapses. We see these a lot in modern film and TV and they're very useful for activists documenting geoengineering and chemtrail programs. Uh, the almost daily institutionalized insanity taking place in our skies overhead around the world. Uh, but I've got three camera setups here and uh, these GoPro Heroes are very useful for this application. But they're affordable, they're small, they're light, they're weatherproof, and they have a really wide angle lens, uh, meaning you can capture a large portion of the sky with just one camera. And they shoot high resolution too, so you get really quality pictures out of these small cameras. That one on the left, that's the new GoPro Hero 3. I've got it uh, on, that's the stand that comes with it and I've got it in an aftermarket case. An advantage to this case is it's really easy to plug the camera into an external power supply. Uh, that means you can run this camera pretty much indefinitely. Uh, you can plug it into you know, one of those little USB power supplies or a computer or a wall outlet and uh, run that for hours. Uh, important if you don't have that set up or even if you do, you can get extra batteries for these these GoPro cameras really affordably like 20 bucks for two batteries and a charger and also important is they have a high capacity memory card I've got a 64 gigabit micro SD card in that Hero 3 and on 720 resolution 60 frames per second I get almost eight hours of record time out of that camera so you could literally set that up in the morning, let it run all day, and see what you caught in the evening. Uh, that center setup, that's the case from that Hero 3 with an aftermarket mount that allows it to screw onto a tripod. That's the UltraPod Mini. Uh, those UltraPods are awesome tripods. Then that setup to the right, that's my original setup. That's one of the original GoPro Hero cameras. Uh, it's got a Believe it or not, just a nut super glued to the bottom so it'll screw onto a normal quarter, quarter inch 20 thread tripod. There are a lot of different ways you can configure these cameras. You can have them take still shots. You can have them shoot video and then just condense that video. Um, so there are a lot of ways to, to set up the time lapse, but most importantly, you need a good camera. Uh, there are plenty of videos out there on how to, how to actually put together the video. But first, you got to get the footage. So these are our three ideas for a camera setup. Uh, check the links below. I've got links to all this equipment, extra batteries, micro SD cards, uh, the tripods, the external frame cases. And if you see something you like, uh, why not buy through those links so I get a portion of the proceeds. Take care. One love. Peace.